Hey everybody, welcome back to Valheim. We are on day 15. So yesterday we fought a troll. Did not go the way I wanted it to. I was trying to fight him with a lot of melee. You know, I, I did initially I did the bow and then I wanted to try and practice my melee skills and see if I could beat him do a melee with the knife. And it did not go my way. It was a long time running around and I kept forgetting to set my spawn point over here and I kept respawning at the other pimp base. So it was pretty funny. If you missed the episode, you might want to watch it. But we did finally end up defeating him, but I had to resort to the bow. But we're going to keep plugging along. We're going to try and improve our skills so that we can fight him better. And we do have better armor now, and that will help. I think I need another box right here. I think I need wood. Let me put another box in here real quick. So I think what we're going to do today is go over to the Black Forest, you know, the same section we've been in where that troll was, and I doubt that he's back yet. Um, we're going to look for a burial chamber and see if we can get in there and get some Sertlin cores. I think we're ready. We have troll armor now, and we have a stag breaker, so I think we'll be fine. And once we get those Sertlin cores, uh, we'll be able to start setting up some portals soon and I want to put one up here and I want to put one up at that temporary base so we'll be able to go back and forth between the two you know because that base is in a pretty good location it's near the mountains and it's also near the black forest so it might be pretty likely that we'll be wanting to go over there Now, last night before I logged out, I did go ahead and put a little chimney around the fire so it won't go out when it's raining. And that's all I did. All right, let's head over there. I don't think we'll run into the troll. As you can see on the map, I did die a couple times. You put my little base icon on here. And it was fun. It was exciting. We had a good time. So I wanted to ask y'all to please hit the like button or subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying my videos because it is so important for a new channel. It affects whether or not YouTube's going to show my videos to new people and grow the channel. So please hit the like button if you can, or subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Let's see, I wonder if we can find some carrot seeds. That would be good. There's some tin. See, it's shiny. I always call it silver. You'll hear me do that, I'm sure. I wouldn't think that troll would be respawned already. Take a look around. There's some carrot seeds, so that's good. Now we need to listen for some ravens. Okay, so that will let you know if there's a fort or a crypt around. hear any. This may just be a small piece of black forest. I don't know. We'll find out as we explore. Not going to worry about the thistle right now.
Let's go this way now. This, that looks like a... Maybe a troll cave. It could be a crypt. Yeah, that's a troll cave. We can get some bones out of there. That may be the cave that troll spawned out of. Now these can make pretty good overnight bases when you're in the forest. You can just put a bed in here and put a little stake wall and sleep the night away. And the troll that's inside won't come out. a fort over there. We're sitting on some copper. Let me mark that. And I'm going to mark that there was a troll cave. I think it was like right here maybe? There's some meadows over there. Let's see who's over here. It may be empty. We may have killed them already. You know, the ones that came after us. Ah. Gotta practice my blocking. Come on, hit me again. <laughs> Any more up here? We needed the bones. Nope. And I don't see any treasure. That's too bad. Might be some running around out here. We can use these bones. Should be some blueberries around here too. You can usually find them around these places. Let's look over here. Yep, there's some. Not much. Oh, look, we found one. Let's see if we can get these uh, skellies that are outside. They're fighting the dwarves. <laughs> Let them duke it out. going back. They cleared them out for us and left the bones. Thank you. See how we can do in here. May be too soon for us to be coming in here. Gonna put a fire out here. Light brighten it up in here. Okay, let's get going. Now I usually sneak in here. Hopefully that's uh can he see us? Yeah, we got him. Let's go this way. Who's in here? I like to go left. You know, when I go through the crypts, you, you just stay left. Nothing in here. There's a spawner up here. Lots of skeletons right here. Yeah, there has to be a spawner.
That's why I like the stag breaker. See how he took them all out? Works great against the skeletons. Works good against the ghosts, too. Look at this. Lots of certain cores. Can you even see in here? There's some amber, some coins, more cores. Desecrating. <laughs> I feel like I'm desecrating it. Wow, that was good. We got 14 cores. Now, if it had been... I've got double resource rate on, so normal, you would have had seven here. Which is very good. Just in this one room. Let me grab a couple of these. Those yellow mushrooms are really good for lighting around the base. I like to put them over the doorways. Which way did I come in? This way, I think. I always check to make sure nothing's going to jump out. You can shut that door if you need to or back up. Nothing down here. This is a dead end. That's a dead end. That's not a surprise because the other one was so good. That first passageway. See, you can you can open it up and fight them. She gonna come out? Come on. Oh, I'm getting suffocated by the smoke. That's one thing you gotta be careful about with the smoke. When you do put it in the middle, that campfire like that. When you run around in there, check your smoke. Their door over there too? Yeah. Oh, look, here's some more. What's in here? Could be a spawner. This will go through the door. Two store. Is he still out there? Yeah. Got him. All right. We can see a little bit better. I think we've cleared it all out. Let's see if there's anything on the ground in here. Sometimes, like when you're when you see these things, there's there's treasure in the middle of them, and it's hard to see. I don't think we've missed anything else. All right, that was great. I actually think we got enough cores to make both the kill and the smelter. I'm gonna leave the fire in here. I don't want to keep that out. Now, I may, may, uh, I'm gonna leave that in here because that way, if I come in here again, I know I've been here. I might pull one on top. I'm not sure. Let's see here. 
snow, it's raining. Let me mark this on the map. I forgot I'm not playing no map mode, so I can do this. <laughs> and cross it out. That way I know I've been in there. I've been doing no map, and then I'm, I find myself doing things still, you know, as if I'm playing no map. Alright, come on. Let me work on my blocking. Get over here. That was good. I'm full up. Well, let's head back. Make our way back to the base. It's probably going to be nighttime soon. Is this the one that we found earlier? Yeah, I think this is it. I've got it marked wrong. Just kill yourself running around in the forest. <laughs> it's always fun in the Black Forest. Alright, here's the meadows. Yep, I'm going to have to take those two deaths off the map. I hate looking at them. <laughs> Here we are, home sweet home. So we can get some fine wood from this guy. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, the tree fell. I don't know if it'll break up against the stump. It might. Give it a try, huh? Come on, come on, come on, come on. We need to put a stake wall around the base, at least along the walls. did not break. Why is this one... We probably need to cut this one a little bit. Let's see here. So we can push them together. can take a while. Let's just do a little bit. It's got to be ready to break. You would think so. Yeah, there's one. This shouldn't take too long. Goodness gracious. Well, we'll do that in the morning. Getting dark. That was good. We got some Sirtland cores, so I'm excited about that. Do we got any meat? I didn't think so. So, let's see here. Let's put a torch in here. It's too dark in here, don't you think? Oh, I've got to put my hammer there. 
I am scattered today. Scatterbrain today. That's what I feel like. And let me eat something. And we'll put up a couple torches in here so that we can actually see what we're doing. Put one on each end. That's better. What do we have in here? We got blueberries. We got some of these. We're just going to store the mushrooms for now. And we'll store the carrots. Can't actually plant those yet until we get a cultivator. Um, we might go get some copper. And we need to find another crypt. And I need more room in here. I mean, I'm already needing more storage, I think. <laughs> Let me see. I can put this in here. Didn't I have I put that? No, nope. that will only take some of that. Put that in there. I'm trying to organize it a little bit. Take that out of there and put that in there. I mean, we can. Well, we're using. Now we can upgrade our club. Let's see here. Yeah. Let's upgrade that. So we want the fine wood bow next. Well, we can probably upgrade that. Might be a good thing to do. Let's see, we got the core wood. And I'm pretty sure we've got that. I don't remember what else we needed for that. Uh, we needed the deer and the leather scraps. I don't know if I had that. Do I have enough? Yeah, I, I think I do. I don't know if I have the deer. Oh, no, I need five. So I don't quite have enough. Alrighty, let's put that in there. Put you up. you in there and you put y'all in there don't have a place for the blueberries um hmm might need to make another box I didn't really want to make one but I think we're gonna have to put one right there those in there. Alright, so I think in the morning we're going to try and put a little bit of stake wall around here. We're going to need to get some more wood. So we might end up having an event soon. And I want to have some safety. Oh, what happened to the fire? What was the point? I have a fire nearby. I wonder if it went out. <laughs> I might have to do some work on that chimney. Good morning. It is day 16. So yesterday we spent a lot of time in the Black Forest. We got some Sirtland cores. And we went through a crypt. It was pretty cool. I had fun with that. I think since we did that yesterday, we're going to go ahead and build a little stake wall around here just to give us some security from the raids. I am going to just take out these for some wood. Then I'll put a little path 
to show where I want to put the stake wall at. It's not going to be too big. It'll just give me a little some safety when we're coming in and out of the base. And it will give us a spot to fight from if we don't want to be on the ground. Okay, let's see. Where's my hoe? And I want to be out just a little ways, so we'll go about here. I'm not planning on, you know, we're not going to be getting trolls coming in the raids. Not till after we defeat the Elder, and by then we should have a bigger base. This is just our little temporary spot while we get the main base ready. There you go. And let's see, let's start putting up the stake wall. Be nice to get this done today. Shouldn't take too long. I will probably set up some ladders for going in and out. Let me just go take down a tree. That will give us more wood. I think we want a lot of wood anyway. We're going to need to put a stake wall around the larger perimeter that we want to do. I mean, eventually I'll probably just use the hoe and raise the ground up. But I don't really want to do that just yet. I'll do that later. Once we're further in the game. It's another pretty day, isn't it? I think after we do this, we may try and get the fine wood that we were trying to get last night. I didn't want to bore you with it too much <laughs> all at once. Look at the sun on the water. Hmm. There we go. How much do we have now? We're almost full. We'll get back over to the wall once we get this wood. There, we're full. It's not on the ground, I don't think. That one's too high in the air, and so it's not connecting like it should. I don't worry about it being perfect. As long as it serves the purpose, I'm not happy. I'm not one of those people who has to have the perfect build. I mean, I think people make some wonderful builds. But I don't do that. I just... try and get it to look halfway decent so I can continue playing. Some people don't even... you know, protect their base. They're just that good, I guess. Got a bunch of wood over here we can use. I 
let's push him down. Yeah, come on back. If we can get that to break. While we're over here, we might as well try it. Awesome. Got some fine wood. Now the other one will probably break now. Yeah, that's it. Now I don't know if it will get injured, take damage by hitting the house or not. Hmm. -mm. Yeah, that's looking pretty decent. I need to fix that. This chimney doesn't look very good. Look, it's not working very well. I might have to redo it. Take it up higher, I think. I'll do that too. So I think today we're just going to be doing little tasks around the base. Try and get some stuff done. How far out do we want to come out? That's far enough, I think. What do I have left? Let's see here. We need to just do this for now while we go get some more wood. Looks like some took damage. Might be the house is that's taking damage. Sorry, I'm jerking the string screen around. It's not going anywhere. Well, let's go get this uh, log over here. I'm just going to cut it. Well, I don't know if we can get it to go that way. Let's try it. This bush is in the way. Maybe we can get this one to hit that one. On the right way. But if we take this out, we can probably get it over there. We want this wood anyway.
Don't go too far. Don't go too far. <laughs> oh, the wrong one went. Oh, well. Let's finish making our entrance over here. Let's see. I think we'll do it here. Oh, yeah, but I'm going to take this out. It's going to be in the way. put up a way to get in and out. We're also going to use this to fight from. And I like to put stairs on each side so I can come in either way. I may use some of that core wood for support. I'm going to have to get some more wood for sure, but I like to make this, this is how I get in and out. But I also like to fight from here when the raid is coming. It's a pretty good spot, you know, until you get an uh, earth wall around. Yeah. Let me get some core wood. We can use that for the supports. And, you know, we can get core wood pretty easy now. Put that in there. Do we have any more wood in here? I don't know if we do. Nope. All out. Let me put the core wood on the other side. I don't have it. here it's not snapping should still support it We're going to put some stake wall in front of this to give us some protection. And that'll give us a nice way to get in and out. And it's secure. You know, I did look it up, and the gates and the, you know, the, the doors don't have nearly as much durability as the stake walls. Stake walls are a lot stronger. So they could tear down, you know, the regular gate or door a lot easier than they're going to tear down the stake wall. So that's why I do it like this. That way they won't go under there trying to fight. And I do like to have some. Let's see here. I like to have some some wall, you know, like some posts up because it does help deflect like when they're throwing rocks and things like that. And it's nice to have something to kind of get behind, but I don't 
This isn't really big enough for that. He, um, I'm going to leave it like this for now. Just put... Might need more wood. Don't have to have a roof. Just thought it might look good. <laughs> I think maybe the small one there. Not it's not quite. Let's see if we can do this one. Not quite meeting up with that, is it? I think it's close enough. Let's see here. Oh, we're out. Let's see here. I don't like the way that looks. I'm going to redo that one. Let me get under here. There, that looks better. So we're probably going to have to do... Let me take that one out. Redo this one. I think I'm out of core wood. Yeah, this is going to be a better spot to fight from. I would even put something there. Let's see, I'm just going to do a regular one. So we should be able to shoot down. I don't know how good we may should be able to. I don't know, we may need to change this a little bit so we can come out and shoot down better. I don't think that that's going to give us what we want, but we'll see. I don't think I'm going to be able to shoot straight down from here like I would. Typically. Let me see if this will connect up there. Might be able to just come stand on that when I want. And shoot down. Hmm. I would like to have that blocked in. I don't like them being able to come down, but the stakes are in the way. can make that lower. I would, but I don't think that's going to happen. Well, we'll just leave it like that for now. Could just put this under here, maybe, to keep them out of here. I mean, it's not strong, but it would... Well, you know what? We're just going to put this under here. Just initially. Just keep them out of there so they're not going under and we can shoot straight down at them. <laughs> yeah, I'm the master. I'm the master, right? And I'll be able to shoot straight down there and come back here when, I'm, when I want. We'll see what, do, what happens. <laughs> Alright, let's put this stuff up. All right, so that will be the end of this episode. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Feel free to leave a comment. I will read them. And I hope you enjoyed it. I'll catch you in the next one. Later, later.